evening. Thank you for joining WTAJ at 6. I'm Matt Alvarez. Maggie has the evening off. The safety of a railroad bridge has long been a major concern of residents in Elk County. And after recently voicing those concerns on Facebook, representatives from the Buffalo Pittsburgh Railroad were in town today to speak with residents. Ariani Tregellis was there, and he brings you this latest on a story you saw first on WTAJ. Johnsonburg residents gathered to voice concerns over the structural integrity of a 103 year old bridge in town after a Facebook post by local resident Rihanna Ferguson raised some questions. My kids and I walk by there a lot to go to the park and you know it's always been a, a concern. The post caught the attention of state representative Mike Arminini who coordinated with the Buffalo Pittsburgh Railroad to visit Johnsonburg and speak with residents. Uh, they do have some cosmetic issues that they uh, plan on, you know, fixing uh, in the near future. Those issues have long feared the residents passing beneath it. The structural sound is okay. Is the is the train going to derail? And it's a bridge. It's like a kid magnet. And being along the sidewalk and a, a busy parking lot, I think it attracts a lot of kids. And it is dangerous under there. In a statement released to WTAJ last week, the Buffalo Pittsburgh Railroad said the track that runs over the bridge is out of service. In the following days, residents sent several videos of trains traveling over the bridge. And today, BPRR's Vice President of Engineering, Todd Draglin, said just one of the two tracks spanning the bridge is in service and reassured residents that the bridge is safe. Thankfully, today, after the railroad explained to them and the very thorough inspections that are done on the bridge, it is 100% safe. Engineers answered questions about the railroad's safety as well as discussing some of the work they will do to repair the deterioration of redundant sections of the bridge. I have a good viewpoint of what the bridge, that the bridge is structurally sound. Um, it's more cosmetic. Draglin says repairs to the bridge were already scheduled prior to these issues being brought forward, and he says they could get underway as early as the new year. In Johnsonburg, Yanni Tregellis, WTAJ News.